Hi, I'm Justin Aquilante, ESA Sales Director, here today with Dana Parmenter, Vice President, CSA Group. Dana, welcome. Great. Thank you, Justin. Thank you for having me. Dana, codes and standards continue to change to address industry energy storage needs. What role does CSA play in the development of codes and standards as it relates to energy storage? Yeah, so CSA Group is a standards development organization. We currently have 10,000 volunteer members across 1,300 technical committees and 3,000 different codes and standards that we administer. Uh, as it relates to energy storage, energy storage is becoming a part of nearly every product as far as it's related to safety. Uh, we see this from vehicles to phones to power tools to even industrial automation equipment. So as these changes happen, we're constantly working with our committees to ensure that these energy storage and battery technologies are incorporated into those standards. Additionally, we're on the forefront of driving a lot of the various standards that we need for the next generation of product coming out, including different type of battery technologies, as well as things like battery management systems. Dana, UL 1973, 9540, and 9540A are prominent certification standards in the energy storage sector currently today. Are you involved in the development of these standards? Yeah, CSA Group plays an important part of developing those standards by participating in the standards technical panel. Uh, so as a contributor with our experts, we, along with others, help shape those standards uh, that get used to certify products for safety. Dana, beyond the deployment of safety standards, does CSA Group also test and certify energy storage products? Yeah, great question. So CSA is also what's known as a TIC organization or testing, inspection, and certification. And we do absolutely do testing for safety and performance standards for a whole range of products. But as it relates to our discussion today, energy storage is a prominent part of that. Uh, CSA is also one of only a handful of what we call NERDLs or nationally recognized testing laboratories who is accredited to test to standards like 9540 and 1973 in order to mark them as safe and meeting the standards. Currently, we perform this work in a variety of areas, including North America, Europe, and Asia, trying to assure that we have testing and certification capability close to the entire supply chain of the customers that we help bring products to market. Dana, with the rapid advancements in the energy storage sector, what is CSA Group doing to assist manufacturers so that they keep up and succeed? Yeah, that's a great question. So we find that complexity of the product and the testing protocols that are involved combined with time to market provide a lot of pressure for manufacturers to be able to get their product tested and determined to be safe before they're actually put out uh, for, for consumer use. Uh, so we've taken a lot of steps to try and facilitate this process, uh, primarily in adding uh, technical expertise and making sure that the right people are always available to help answer questions uh, and assist customers in getting their product certified. And importantly, we're adding capacity. So uh, in the next 12 months, we'll have 43,000 square foot of specialty energy space coming into our laboratory. That's gonna be dedicated to energy technologies. In addition, we're making further investments in Europe and Asia that are all contributing to making sure that there's plenty of resource and expertise to help bring these products that are rapidly developing to market. Uh, really the access to that expertise and being able to assure that you have timely responses so the product isn't being held up late in its design and it can get to market quickly has proven to be one of the real key assets that we've been able to bring to, to the market. Dana, what is one major benefit you believe a manufacturer would experience if they contacted CSA Group today to certify an energy storage system? Of course, I would say it's more than just one. Uh, I always lean to our technical expertise, but I think that the big thing that stands out to me today that would be very important for somebody contacting us uh, deals in some of the testing around 9540A. Uh, the 9540A test program is dealing with thermal runaway of batteries and involves a fire test, which is quite complicated and a very specially programmed to have done. Uh, so where it comes to that test, we found historically uh, manufacturers of products were looking at anywhere from six to 12 months to be able to get that test done, which is a big step in that development process. We've been able to add a lot of capacity both in the last year and preparing for more in the coming year to ensure this test moves much more quickly so currently, somebody coming to CSA could have this test begun in as early as two weeks if they're ready to bring their product in. Dana, thanks for joining me here today. Certainly learned a lot about CSA Group. I've recapped a couple of points that I'd like to highlight here. One, how you have capacity to perform 9540A fire testing. Two, the opening of your center of excellence this year in the US, a 43,000 square foot facility for testing energy, store energy storage batteries. And lastly, 
You're continuing to grow and create opportunities for experts to join your team. You're currently hiring with many positions to fill. Congratulations on all the success, and we look forward to hearing more from you in the near future. Great. Thank you, Justin. I appreciate it. See you in Phoenix. Thank you.